Good evening, folks. Hello there. Welcome, welcome, everybody. I'm Angel Arrow. I'm going to entertain you for the next two hours. We're going to have a look at Open Beta 1.44 for Euro Truck Simulator 2. Good evening and welcome, Bossy and Stain. Good evening, buddy. Everything all right right now? Everything is all right. If that is going to stay like that, I have no idea. We will see when the lady gets home with the oldest one. Only a couple are going to know what I'm talking about. All right, here we are. Euro Truck Simulator 2. Um, 1.44. It's not published yet, guys. This is an open beta. Everybody can um play the open beta you just go to steam uh you go to your library on the left side in the column you have euro truck simulator 2 right mouse click on it go to properties go to the beta section and activate beta 1.44 um and yeah here we go this is 1.44 my beloved volvo and let's fire it up let's fire it up and then you're going to see something fantastic lights on engine on there we go and just have a look guys yeah we are having adjustable suspension back and front how cool is that how cool is that ladies and gents look the back down Woohoo! this is going to be way better for those moments where we can't get underneath our trailer and then we have to slam into that trailer now we just lower the suspension and we can pick up the trailer but also we can make our truck low although they didn't overreact with this but i can see mods coming or changes within the settings file where we will be able to drop down the suspension even more than this but this is already pretty look at that if we even put the back a little bit up or completely up how much that nose is hanging on the ground mate Woo! unbelievable unbelievable but let's lower it a bit and there is also one key that is just resetting it all together this is a reset but we are going to drop it like it down drop it like it down all righty nice truck cool thank you thank you thank you thank you lights on Bing. Bing. high beams check blinkers check check uh what else can we check oh hazards check and the back check brake check driving backwards check everything check beacons do we have beacons beacons check horn Woohoo! and we're going to drive yeah baby but first of all i need to activate convoy uh, for those who want to drive with me, always possible, but you need to have Open Beta 1.44 now. As you can see, all the mods I'm normally using are working on the beta as well, so that is not an issue. Here we go. And uh, we're going to drive through, and that is another part of uh, Open Beta 1.44 or Update 1.44 that is coming our way. We're going to drive through... Austria, Austria got a complete revamp and from what I've seen on videos and pictures already, it looks marvelous. We will definitely have to stop here and there, take a picture and pay attention to the background. The, the, the mountains in the background are just terrific. All right. 
How is everybody doing tonight? What the fuck is this? Tomorrow, Formula One sprint race at 4.30 Central European time. 4.30 p.m. of course, Central European time. Sprint race! Max Verstappen starting 1, Hamilton starting 13. <laughs> what I think of uh, Hamilton doesn't really matter, but now again, they made an interview, they did an interview with him, and he was so, so, so depressed, mate. So it's not going his way it's not going like he's used to the last seven years eight years and um he's so depressed man and it's not his fault it's the team's fault yay what a prick mate so there's the proof if you have a good car or the better car you're going to win if you don't have the better car you're going to suck just like he does ha <laughs> unbelievable mate on freaking believable but then if you are a seven years champion and even though it's not going your way at the moment oh come on mate then just be a little bit positive you can be you can be disappointed with how things are going but in the interview you can still show that you're a seven times world champion and brighten up a little but no he's he's just so such a sad person, mate. Unbelievable. Um, I jumped into my truck and I'm going over all the new content Whoop. that comes with update 1.44 or hashtag euro truck simulator 2 point right here is open Beta 1.44. Point. 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 Emote. Emote. And p -p 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 post. Alrighty, what are we going to do? I got an email again. Oh, yeah, baby. We also got the Bratislava. A heavy cargo, new heavy cargo, um, special cargo. Bratislava. Uh, come and join the fun. I'll be glad if I could take the game properly. Bam. A post. Right. Did I get messages from the lady? No, not yet. Alrighty, guys, we're going to drive a little bit. Uh, first of all, we need to jump to somewhere in uh, somewhere in somewhere in. Look at that! It's all not discovered yet. Oh my god! It's not discovered yet. No. Let's go to Salzburg. Yeah, let's go to Salzburg. 
garage manager um show me the map please and we go to Linz. no innsbruck let's go to innsbruck let's travel Alrighty, Vettel 5 has mate. Hey, mate. Yeah, mate. Oh, Magnuson. Fantastic, mate. Magnuson. That is the best result for Haas since it came to Formula 1. <laughs> but, of course, it's just a position for the sprint race. It doesn't say anything about the race itself on Sunday. It's all about uh, the sprint race, so... Yeah, tomorrow, 4.30 p.m. Central European time. Sprint race in Italy. Verstappen at one, but Leclerc Ferrari is right up his ass. So, yeah, I'm anxious to see who's going to come over the line as first. Yeah, Sunday it's Formula 1, but tomorrow it's already sprint race. And the outcome of the sprint race is the starting position for Sunday. Therapy. That's what I need. Therapy. Ow, 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 ow. Woo! Eh, 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 eh. Okay, let's see. Do we have gas? Do we have enough gas? It's filled. It's filled. Whoop, whoop. Oh, we need to go back. Hey, sir. We need to go back, sir. Ooh, wee! All right. So, we're going to try to find a job within... Austria. I would very much like to stay within Austria, and otherwise I need to create my own jobs. We'll see. So, from Innsbruck to... Now, of course, they are not going to give me anything to Austria. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, yippee We're going to Salzburg. Let's go, ladies and gents. Whoop, whoop. Off we go. It's been a while since I played ETS2 as well. I was lately, I was always playing uh, American Truck Simulator, right? Oh, he makes me die again. Remco Bossy makes me die again. Wet, 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 wet. Up in my... Yeah. Uh, Senna didn't die for uh, because of wet track. So we, we actually need to uh, look around. We have a skate park over there. We have uh, basketball. Look at that guy, mate. Oh my God. We need to, we need to have a look at that. We definitely need to have a look at that. Oh, 
Oh my god, look at those muscles. I don't know if it's muscles or just, uh, what the hell? Who is it? Is that Alex? No, that's not Alex. Look at dude. Opa! Through his legs. Woo! -hoo! Do it again. Opa! Through his legs. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah, baby. He knows how to handle a ball. He knows how to handle a ball. And there we have the Squate Park. Yabba! Woohoo! Wow! Come back, buddy. One more time. Wow, wow, wow. Come back, come back, come back. Yep. Yeehaw. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what I have, but it's uh it's good. I don't know what I use, but it's good. It's good. Let's start in four high. Uh, we we definitely need to pay attention to everything here. I can't even remember how Austria looked like. But... I can't even remember how it all... Oh, look at that. Look at that in the back. Oh, my God. Those mountains, mate. That river here. Look at those mountains in the background. Woo-hoo-hoo! Zentrum. It's definitely... Uh, Look at those mountains, mate. Wow. Oh, yeah, baby. Mountains, mountains, mountains. Austria. I will have to drive a lot with the camera outboard, third person view, right? Otherwise, we're not going to see a lot. Oh, beautiful song. Yeah, reach your destination. Whoop, whoop. Boom, boom, boom. A little girl wanna go for a ride. Me, my wagon, it's parked right outside. They can cross to I think I just rape you and kill you instead. Diane, 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 Boo -be -do -boo. At Lake of It'd be much easier if I drove. All right, let's take the crown one. There we go. It's an urgent delivery. Come on, take a ride with me. Yeah. Diane, 
You see, and now it's actually too high, so... <laughs> oh, this is so cool. This is so cool. Now. Aha. Woo. Damn, boy. Or we can just, uh, this is normal. Then we're going to push it down. Bam. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah, baby. Diane. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, yeah, shit. Third person. Oh, I'm not used to drive like that. Oh, look at that building already, right in front of us. And the mountains. But, oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh, look at that front, mate. It's almost hitting the ground. I'm definitely going to have issues <laughs> here. Crack. No? Oh, no, it goes through. Oh. What is that over there? Oh, wait a minute. I need to see that. What is that over there? Uh, what do we have right here? What is this? Ah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a rocky formation. That is... Wow. Did they really create that like this in real life as well? And here we have the um, the train thingy, tracks. Oh, my God. The train thingy, ladies and gents. We have the train thingy. <laughs> train thingy. Oh, look at those mountains, mate. Uh, we will have to say again in a bit that uh, they definitely hit the mark again. Okay, let's go. Let's go. This is, uh... We have to look at everything, right? So, completely Austria got an overhaul, so we, we really need to pay attention to every little detail. And to be frankly honest, I can't tell when I was actually driving in Austria for the last time. I have no idea. I have really no idea. Hmm. 
What do we need to do now? Left, right? Are you going to tell me something, GPS? Please? No? Nothing? Are you kidding me? Nothing! Why are we not getting anything? God damn it! Oh. Let's wait. Let's go to the official photo studio. I think I can take a nice picture here with the house and the flowers on the corner. <sighs> or not. <laughs> or not. <sighs> Like this. Don't mind the um the sound in the background. I'm going to make sure that it's going to disappear. Somebody is in my channel here. Mic open, but I have no idea what's happening there. <laughs> no idea whatsoever. Hey guys, do you see what I see in the background? Way, way far in the background. You see what I see? I see a castle right here. A castle. A castle. All right, let's go. But I'm not used to driving uh, third person view. I always drive like this, first person. So. I will have to, um, yeah, think of changing every time. I have the fire department behind me. Oh, oh, oh. Come on, turn green. Oh my god, freaking stupid retarded dogs! Primal. Primal gas station. Primal. Oh my goodness, retarded dogs. It is beautiful with those mountains, isn't it? Oh, I'm I'm not used to drive like this. Whoop, whoop. I'm not used to drive like this. Oi! Hey. Welcome, Tess. All righty. We really yeah, need to pay attention to surroundings. What is this? What the hell is this? Is it agricultural? Oh no, it's uh it's a way station. It's a way station. A way station. 
really. I'm going to one day when I grow up, there will be a day where I'm just going to kill every dog here. I'm just kidding, guys. Just kidding. Before somebody starts calling around to animal control, Paw Patrol. Paw Patrol! Paw Patrol! Let's put, uh, uh, and, uh, there we go, you numb nut, cruise control on 80, look at that scenery, a church there, on the right side over there, a little church in the middle of nowhere. No, it's not really in the middle of nowhere. There is like a small village here. Oh, swimming pool there next to the house. Woo! People with money do strange things. <laughs> And we have the next community already with their own church. Like, there are two churches in... Ra oh, and way in the background over there. We have an Orthodox church. Oh, my goodness. It's like, we're going to put all our churches in Austria. Yay! <laughs> Say hi to Angel from us. I don't think somebody is still in here because the dogs are freaking pissing me off. I will say hi when she's back in, but I think they are at the neighbors or something across the street. Stupid dogs. Nobody who wants to buy a dog or two. God damn, I... Those dogs are pissing me off. Look at these colorful gas stations with green and purple. Was that already like that? Green and purple? Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. Did my truck just... My suspension go up automatically? Are you kidding me? It's like my suspension is normal eh? don't tell me we can change that while driving no 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 we can't change it while driving luckily no 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 we can't change while driving and that is also not possible, I think. Oh, Billy! Oh, I'm sorry, guys, but I'm going to pull over. Um, I'm going to kick the dog. No, no. <laughs> So, Austria. Oh, look at that. Oh, beautiful. Austria is beautiful. There is smog coming up. Fra -da -da -da. Man, I'm I'm really Billy. 
My god, my... Retarded dogs. The only reason why they are still here is because of my daughters. Otherwise, they were already long gone. Definitely. Did we have those um, bright colored gas stations already? Primal. Deep left. Oh, I am left. I didn't move. Oh, I didn't move, honey! Finally, they're back in. God damn. Is Angel here? Yeah. Moi, hello, Stan. Hello, Stan! What the fuck, man? Retorted, stupid, <laughs> cunt dogs. Yeah, do 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 Vienna. You can see that I'm not used to drive like this in third person view. Bah, damn, mate. Absolutely not. I would rather drive in first person, but then we're not going to see a lot of. Of the revamp of Austria. <laughs> Tunnels. Oh my goodness, then. Oh. Damn. Yeah, that was a good one. Oh, shit. Oh, that was so not healthy. That was so not healthy, mate. <laughs> you car are going to stop. You don't realize yet. Oh, shit. I'm going to stop as well. Apparently, I'm going to stop as well. Yay. So we get the... Uh, oh. Wipers on. The VPS. Let's put on the VPS. Yeah. That was a good one. And that's still the best one, actually. Like, when Jens comes in, he's using a lot of jump scares that he can uh, buy with bits. But uh, the one I gave you guys through channel points are actually... That's actually the best jump scare I've had so far. That is, that is one that makes me jump. All the others are, I don't know, not that great, not that fantastic. So we are in Austria and it's raining.
Left turn ahead. We have a left turn ahead. Turn left. Turn left. You have reached your destination. Ladies and gents, if you didn't know yet, I have reached my destination. Where do I need to park? I need to park right there. We're uh, going to do right in a little circle. Like this. And like this. Oh, the new uh, head tracking devices are out of track hat. That's right. New head tracking devices, yes. But like I said, um, nothing changes or changed to the device at your head. It's the camera that completely changed. So there is no, uh, absolutely no use for me to uh, buy a new one. Well, I couldn't. Or, but I uh, definitely have to look again to um, connect it again so that I can drive with my hair tracking device again. A better way would actually be me having a virtual reality. Yay! <laughs> you can play these games with VR as well. Although, I'm not sure if you can play them immediately when a new update comes out. I think there is some uh, porting needed to get it to VR compatible. I don't know how it works. Track hat or a hat tracking device is always working, of course. There we go. And... I'm too late. Why am I too late? Oh, yeah, it was an urgent delivery. Crap. Crap, crap, crap. Made a mistake. I... I made a mistake. Flashbang. There we go. But I have the feeling that... You see? While I was driving, my truck went up. Why is that? While I was driving, my truck was in standard position. And I didn't do that. So that's weird. That is something we need to pay attention to if that happens automatically, yes or no. That shouldn't be happening. If I say lower suspension, then it's lower suspension. This is cool, right? Drop it. And drop it. Yep. Higher. Higher. Oh, uh, look at me. I'm Mr. Big Guy. Yeah. I want to be small. And low. Oh, look at that nose. <laughs> It almost touches the ground. Of course, here it's way up. Uh, that is not uh, not beautiful. Let's keep it as that. But let's pay attention when we're driving. If it uh, automatically resets to normal position, that shouldn't be happening. That's if that is the case, that shouldn't be happening. Okay, let's do another job and try to stay in Austria. We are now in Salzburg, and I want to stay in Salzburg, if possible. Yep, we're going to Klagenfurt. Coca-Cola. 
Take and kill him, baby. Where do I need to pick up? Um, yeah, not here. That much is not here. Let's go. I'm off, mate. You go, go bad. The whole week, wake up on 3 a.m. Woo-wee! The whole week, mate. Wow. Well, I will, uh, I will turn around for... He's sleeping, mate. That was growling. Oh, my God. I'm going to put him in the AFK channel just a sec. He's just snoring. Oh, my God. Jason, move to AFK. There we go. Or I should let him stay in the channel and see what else he's going to do in his bed, in his sleep. Maybe he's going to talk in sleep. <laughs> No, we don't want him in the channel. Maybe he's going to do some dirty stuff. <laughs> uh, turn what? What did she say? Right. I did turn right. Turn right. Turn right, Clyde. <laughs> Alrighty, Stan. See you later, buddy. Um, de grote dag. Ja, ik heb hem zo weer. Ik weet het. <laughs> dus het toch maar. <laughs> Greetings over there. Have a good night. And uh, tomorrow at uh, 2 a.m. I will uh, give you a wake-up call to say, oh shit, I missed an hour. <laughs> Go back to bed for an hour. <laughs> That would be a good one, wouldn't it? <laughs> Me calling you at 2 a.m. to say that I missed and you have to get up at 3 a.m. Go back to bed. <laughs> uh, no? Oh, that would be... That wouldn't be so great. I think I get kicked around and slapped around then by the wife because I wake her up as well. Because I'm going to do that phone call from within my bed. Hello, motherfucker. Hello, motherfucker. Goodbye, motherfucker. <laughs> Goodbye, Stan. See you later, buddy. Thanks for passing by. Thanks for passing by. Primal gas station. Oh no, primal. Sorry. Yeah. It was like Pimmel. Pimmel gas station. Later, Zamego. Have a good night, buddy. Have a good night. Don't let the bad bugs bite. And if they do, buy a new mattress. And look at this bridge. This is for the tram. Oh, no, it's not. It's for uh, buses. Trolley buses. Or not the, like, the, um, yeah, trolley. How are those buses called? Buses. Electric, electric buses. But uh, powered like a tram. Powered like a tram. Powered like a tram. Powered like a tram. I hope I'm driving into the right direction. I mean, I'm driving around without a map.
Ja, trolleybus. De trolleybus. Lots of uh, advertisement for home trick. Furniture. Good burger. Eat. Food. Food around the corner. Food around the corner. Food around the corner for me. Dee, 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 dee. Food around the corner. Food around the corner. Food around the corner for me. Beep, beep. That stupid lantern pole is really in the way, mate. Really in the way, huh? Well, we're going to uh, Photoshop that out. Eh? Yeah, 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 yeah. We're going to Photoshop that out. Hmm. Oh, look at this. Those houses with the, the balconies, the the oh my god. This is beautiful. So beautiful. This is nice, isn't it? Left turn ahead. Turn left. Yay. Left turn ahead. Oh, we're hitting the curbs. <laughs> Woo! Turn left. Oh, thank you. Hello, tram. The tram is going uh, through the... Wow. Look at that glass building in the background there. Colico. Colico. Okay, and now I will have to drive normally because, um, oh no, it's not an urgent delivery. Never mind, never mind, I didn't say anything. Where do I need to pick up, though? It would be cool to know. Oh, right in front of me. Oh my god, if it, wa if it was a dog, it would have bitten me, mate.
Okay. Did it now automatically? I am. No, it didn't. No, it didn't. Okay, here we go. I was uh, looking at details. Did you know that you can actually see the degrading of your wheels after many kilometers? Like when you did 5,000 kilometers or something? That you can actually see the degradation of the wheels? Turn right. Yes, sir. We're going to turn right. Austria. Now oh, you can definitely see changes. I can definitely see changes. You. You definitely have to make lots of turns to get out of here. Yes. It's automatically pushing my truck up. Is that the way it should be? Is that, a, is that in real life? I don't know, but... In real life with a truck, is that the same thing? If you drive over a... I, I think when you go faster than 50 kilometers an hour or something, I think it's some sort of system like that then. That it automatically resets your suspension? We heard the... And I have a feeling, we are going to have a look here, but I have a feeling that our truck suspension got reset again. Yeah, it got reset. Look! What the hell? I said, down, goddammit! It's resetting. Oh, is it green? <laughs> Not for long. I'm going to pay attention, but I think when I go over 50 kilometers an hour, there we are going to hear the, uh, the sissing of uh, the system. We are now driving 38, 41... 
41. I need to pay attention here a bit though. Yeah. Okay. 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. Yep. 50 kilometers an hour and the suspension goes up automatically. What? Hey, Chris. Good evening, buddy. Oh, that is not... No, I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. So, for those who thought, just like me, like, oh, cool, we can drop our trucks all the way down. That's going to be a fantastic look. Forget it. The moment you reach 50 kilometers an hour, the whole suspension gets reset automatically. Wow. Hey, Chris, everything's going all right, mate. What's up? Dad, I'm not happy with the suspension. <laughs> so we can now drop our truck completely front and back or, or hire it front and back. But the moment you reach 50 kilometers an hour, it automatically resets to the normal driving height. That is not cool. I don't know if that works that way in real life. I'm not a truck driver. I should check that out or ask kids. Oh, maybe I should ask my friend who's a truck driver. Oh, look at that here with the glass panels. The glass panels here are really cool. Really cool. Nice music, thanks. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I don't like the fact that suspension automatically resets. So, for driving purposes, you can't drive with a lowered suspension. Wow. That is not cool. That is not cool. Probably if I'm going to ask on the forums or something, I'm going to get an, an answer in the trend of, in real life, it does that as well. So again, for all those who thought, hey, we're going to have cool looking rigs with the suspension all the way down, forget it. At 50 kilometers an hour, it automatically resets. Forget about it. There goes my fun. God damn it. <laughs> Is that a mod you're using for the suspension? Absolutely not, mate. Absolutely not. The suspension that you can uh, change, the front and the back, up and down, is by default in the game the moment they are going to release update 1.44. I'm now driving on open beta, public beta 1.44, and that suspension thing is a feature, is a new feature coming to the game. A new feature coming to the game, yeah. But I don't like it. I don't like the fact that it's resetting. I don't like it. No. It's cool when you're standing still and all, but the fact that it resets at 50 kilometers an hour, nah, not cool. Not cool. Not cool, not cool, not cool. Not cool, not cool. Maybe it isn't meant to, but yeah, of course it's meant that way. They programmed it that the moment you reach 50 kilometers an hour, the suspension goes up. And probably in real life, that's exactly the same. 
but keep focusing on the surroundings St. Michael so we are in um, Austria we're going to stay in Austria I'm taking lots of pictures That's always dangerous, of course, taking lots of pictures. Definitely when you're driving forward and you're looking backwards. <laughs> Fuck me. Woo! Shit. Falling through the map. Oh my goodness. Okay, there we go. That whole truck is completely finished. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. That whole truck is completely finished. And it's going down and down and down and down. Ah, oh, holy shit. What's this new feature? <laughs> hey, Stone Crusher. Hello, everybody. Just watched a video on it. And yeah, suspension goes up and down when picking up a trailer in real life. Yeah, of course I know in real life that it's going up and down, Chris. I know how it works in real life. Well, I know w what it's for in real life, I mean. I just don't know if in real life, the moment you hit a certain uh, speed, like in the game it's programmed at 50 kilometers an hour, that it then automatically resets the suspension on the normal drive height. So we fell through the map, ladies and gents. My job is completely ruined. That much is for certain. Fuck me. That's a swan dive. Yeah, that's that's the swan dive feature. Didn't you hear of it? <laughs> the swan dive feature, yeah. I have no map mods whatsoever, so uh, why I'm falling through that map there, I have no fucking clue. No clue whatsoever. Your truck is not in condition for quick travel. Repair your truck or call for an assistance. Are you freaking kidding me? Are you kidding me? Uh... I know in real life, Chris, that the suspension that goes up and down and then especially the back suspension of the back axle, um, they do lower that to get properly under a trailer. Some trailers are a little bit low, even in the game we have that. And then we have to drive backwards and slam our trunk into it so that it, it connects. But now we can really use the suspension to, to make it go up and down. But... My thing was like, if we going, oh my god, it's completely, completely, completely ruined, mate. It's completely ruined. But my thing was, if you can play with that suspension, you you can see it already, right? That nose, drop it down, just like you have those mods that are actually dropping the chassis. So that you have a low rider truck. But that is not possible with this new feature, apparently. If they are not going to change it, it's not going to be possible. It's only going to be possible to take cool pictures while you're standing still, but not when you're driving. 
Because at 50 kilometers an hour, again, at 50 kilometers an hour. Why am I so freaking... Yeah, okay. At 50 kilometers an hour, it uh, resets the suspension, apparently. Which is not cool. That is the part that I don't think is cool. I had more than 100,000 costs. <laughs> well, what the fuck? <laughs> As you can see now, we can drop it. Uh. Okay. We can drop it here. All the way down. We can even put the back all the way down. But then it doesn't really look like your truck is down at the front. But uh, yeah, I'll need an airplane, yeah. <laughs> For what I... Okay. We can reset it ourselves, but that is what's happening at 50 kilometers an hour. It resets. We can drop it like this. We did a bit higher there. Look how low he is. But look at what's happening at 50 kilometers an hour. <laughs> I think that suspension is uh, playing with me a little bit. <laughs> Woo! Oh my goodness. What is happening here, mate? Oh, 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 oh my truck is... Uh, I'm driving backwards. What? There is an invisible ramp here, mate. I don't know what's happening. Uh, woo! SES software, you guys did a really good job here, mate. Really. It's it's a cool feature. It's a cool feature. It's a cool feature. ET phone home. ET phone home. ET phone home. Yeah, I'm touching the ground again. So I'm, uh, I'm hitting a ramp here or something. Look. Why am I hitting a ramp here? Uh, Hitting an invisible ramp. <laughs> oh, shit.
Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I know why. We are nowhere near. Oh, shit. We are nowhere. Oh, my God. Arrow, mate, you're a moron. We are nowhere near a drivable road. Oh, my goodness. No wonder. No wonder. No wonder. <laughs> Woo! That is what you get when you're not using a map, right? That is what you get when you're not using a map. I'm sorry, guys. But we're still having that uh, suspension issue. So at 50 kilometers an hour, it automatically resets. And I'm driving off the map again. So we're going to have some issues real soon again, I guess. Bomb. Can we enter here? Oh, we were going to have another feature in 1.44. That's right. We were going to have a feature where the hidden roads are actually going to get detected and shown on the map. But uh, from what I can see, this is not showing. So I have a whole invisible road that I did. But it's not showing. So wait a minute. Wait a minute. That was going to be another new feature. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, where are we? There. So normally... This is weird. This is weird. No, normally we were going to get a new feature where the moment you start using um, roads that are not on the map, that they are going to get shown in a dotted line, a broken line, a dotted line. And also with the colors, like, gray is unexplored and yellow is explored. But now I did a secret road here, like going around, entering the company at the back, and coming back here. And it doesn't show. It doesn't show. It doesn't show. Hmm. That's weird. That was going to be a new feature. Hmm. <laughs> Alrighty. So let's have... I need a screenshot of that. Let's have a screenshot of this. There we go. And then here... We can actually drive around and it doesn't show. Probably when you have to enter a company, it's not going to show. The hidden... Re what? Engine malfunction? Why? Okay. We need to go to the... Oh. Oh my god.
Alrighty, let's put it. Not a new engine. Let's, uh, yeah, there we go. Well, I can as well put that other engine in, right? Let's have a look. I'm using this one. I can as well take the one with the loop. Here it is. There we go. We can as well use that one. Oh, that's one. It wow. This one sounds ah, all right. All righty, righty, righty. How are you doing, Chris? How are things going on uh, your new job, buddy? How are things going on your new job? Your sounds, volume, music, volume. Okay, let's see. Oh, is it already that late? Listen. All right. I think I'm going to um, park it at my own garage. Have a look at my heyday for a sec. And then call it today. Oh my god, and there we go again. Retarded dogs. I never paid attention to these um, fuel stations. But I would say that this is new as well. With the colorful colors, primal, red and green, and, and here it's red and yellow, and we also saw red and, what was the other thing we saw? Purple or something? Purple? Where do I need to be? I don't know anymore. Where do I need to be? There we go. Hey. So yeah, I don't like the fact that the suspension is actually resetting automatically. I don't like that. So I was so stoked about the suspension, about the new feature. And it is cool though, in a way, it's every new thing is always cool, right? It's always cool to have new things to the game. But... Um... I'm a bit disappointed. I'm a bit disappointed. I thought even though in real life you don't really do that, but I thought that in game we would have been able to drive around with those cool rigs, nose down, you know, and apparently it's not possible. That's a pity. That's really a pity. I'm a bit disappointed, yeah. I'm disappointed. That was something I was looking forward to so hard. And it all drops at 50 kilometers an hour. Actually, it doesn't. It rises at 50 kilometers an hour. <laughs> it is a cool thing, though, for those situations. And we have those situations a lot where you 
go backwards you want to couple a um you want to connect to a trailer and the trailer is hanging too low and then the only thing we can do is driving backwards slamming our truck into that trailer until it connects so we are not going to have that issue anymore because we can just lower the oh 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 we can just lower the suspension at the back then drive underneath the trailer and then we can or just totally reset or manually go up or down and even put it more but um yeah i don't like it i don't like it like this this looks cool right and yes i know it's not natural to drive like this but it just looks cool i thought now that we're going to have that as a default feature in the game we will not need those mods that are actually dropping your chassis but we still need the mods that are going to drop your chassis because yep it automatically resets unless wait a minute unless folks unless i overlooked a setting in gameplay maybe where it says that it has to reset automatically let's have a look can we find something related to the Can we find something related to automatic resetting? No, we have not. We have not. No, we have not. It would have been nice if they gave us Now, it would have been nice if they gave us the possibility to disable the automatic reset. Maybe that's... Maybe that's um, a good suggestion. Maybe that's a good suggestion. I'm still looking a bit through everything, but um, all those things like activating or deactivating stuff like that is in the gameplay tab, so it's not in there. Don't forget, guys, if you want to have that automatic suspension system, then you need to go to key and buttons. And on top now, you have extra... Uh, settings here front suspension up front suspension down rear suspension up rear suspension down and suspension reset but that suspension reset they should give us an option in gra in um, gameplay they should give us an option here to um, disable the automatic reset at uh, 50 kilometers an hour I really hope that is going to come to the game. Otherwise, that whole system is like... I don't know. It's, it's, it's cool. Don't get me wrong. It's cool. I love new features in the game. I love the more realistic touch that they are giving us. Bit by bit by bit by bit. Um, they are always coming with new things that are making it even more simulator. Right? But sometimes you just want to drive with that very cool rake drop down not using mods and that is not possible that is apparently not possible that's a pity i'm i'm disappointed i'm really disappointed i think you can hear and tell <laughs> but okay guys i'm going to leave it for what it is for today uh we're going to save yeah we're going to save there we go and
and we're going to completely leave it for what it is today i'm going to try to swallow my disappointment <laughs> i'm immediately going to create um a some feedback on their forum where they want the feedback to come and i'm going to ask for a an extra setting in the gameplay menu where you can activate or deactivate the automatic reset at 50 kilometers an hour so yeah and what are we tomorrow saturday we are definitely going to drive our truck tomorrow night definitely so all those who want to drive with me it's all good um i'm always having my convoy open but remember this time you need to have public beta 1.44 maybe you don't want to install that yet and wait until it gets released but then you can't drive with me you need open beta 1.44 alrighty guys i hope you enjoyed this short stream for tonight uh, i wish you all a very good night and uh hopefully see you back tomorrow bye bye